Hi guys, welcome to Aquarius season. It's snowing outside, it's cold, it's chilly. The sun actually entered Aquarius last night, which was January 19th, so happy birthday to my fellow Aquarians. I'm in my car, I'm working today, and I'm meeting one of my clients actually, she's a Scorpio. There's so much going on, I, I can't even like begin to explain to you guys. I have my ups and downs, highs and lows, this is like, this is life. Omar and I recently got married in October, so it's now January, been like three, four months. Adjusting to marriage and moving out of my parents' house after living there for 27 years, it's very mentally challenging, but um, trying to find some, some way to like cope with all of this. I don't think a lot of people talk about it. It's, uh, it's tough, it's very, very tough. It brings me a lot of joy to be vlogging because I can finally come out of my shell. I've been in hermit mode for so long. Uh, the only time I'm able to like fully, I guess, come out of that is during Aquarius season. <laughs> This is chicken Thai salad. It's freaking amazing. Time to go, time to go. <laughs> Is that a camera? Who's in there? No, no, no. That's Chiefy, if you guys have not met him yet. He's Omar's dog, um, but now he's my dog because I'm his mom. Say hello. Him and Race have the same birthday, which is absolutely crazy, but yeah, they're both Pisces. Omar went into Rite Aid, so I'm just chilling in the car, just chilling in the car. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to hide in the back and then I'm going to pop up and you're not going to know where I am. Are you guys ready? Because I'm ready. What I got to do is fast, like fast. We're in the middle of moving, so like all of our stuff is in the back of the car, including these random wires. Okay, are you guys ready? What the fuck is this? Ow! The hell is she? <laughs> what are you doing? I'm, I'm gonna <laughs> prank you. How are you gonna prank daddy? Good morning, sleepyhead. I love you. Morning, you guys. It is day three of Aquarius season. Um, I'm not off to a good start. Uh, I have like a really bad cramp in my backside. I don't know what I did, but you know, it came out of nowhere and I'm so uncomfortable. I tried like a few stretches, but it's not helping completely out. Hopefully it'll go away. I've been drinking some water. Maybe that will help. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. I'm back home with the dogs. Um, so I picked up Brace because I can't be away from him for like more than two days. Like I start to like mentally go insane. Omar went to our place to like clean up before we move in. Hopefully sometime in the next week or so. I'm just like looking forward to that next step. I still have a pain in my backside. It won't go away. I'm just gonna try to like move around, see what I can do. I think I'm probably gonna go upstairs and like make some food. <laughs> <laughs> Me and a mess. We are winding down, folks. We just took a much needed shower. I feel so refreshed. One's on my left side and one's on my foot. Hello? One of these two culprits just farted, and I'm going to find out who. That stench, okay? Cold over there? Yeah, we had cold now. Nice. Same shit, bro. Grace is running around. So we're currently at our house, but it's being renovated. Still got a long way to go. Babe, there's like paint all over the place. 
Renovation is tough. Omar's doing a little bit of cleaning, cleaning. That sun looks pretty cool trying to pop through. Found him. We're trying to find carpets and this is the one that I liked because it has some like color in it, but not too much. And I really like the design. We are happy, happy. Yeah, because I tied it in pretty hard. Yeah, I got my hair shit pretty hard. Y'all wanna clean it? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. A family ride, you know what I'm saying? Oh my god, we in a building, man. Shit. Get it, get it, get it, head to the new crib. This is where we live. Outside with the dogs. They're running around. There goes Chief. We have races outside? Yeah. It's gonna be alright, though. Hey, how long? You want to talk about this story? It's uh, two, three hours. Yeah. Alright, Caleb. Come on. Good boy. We're very cold. Um, we did a lot of cleaning today. We brought the dogs along with us just so they can, you know, get used to it, run around, um, and have a little bit of fun, you know? But I am starving. Race, come here, baby. Chief. Chief. Where is it, baby? Hi guys, good afternoon. Let me just spray myself with this hand sanitizer. Even though my hands are like so dry because of it. I just left work. I'm waiting for my car to heat up. I'm very cold. I don't feel well at all today actually. My body is crumbling. Uh, that's like the best way I can describe it. Just the last couple of months I have not been um, mentally there. From what I've learned in therapy is I try to look for approval so I, I have noticed that about myself I've tried to lean back the second I lean back and started placing boundaries I've had like people um, just putting more on my plate my mind is going like 100 miles per hour so I'm trying to uh, just relax it's in these moments where I just like, I just want to be completely alone, and sometimes the people around me don't get that. They they just think I'm hiding, or I don't want to be near them, or I don't want to help them, or whatever. But my brain is like, who do I help next? What do I do next? Where do I go next? And um, I'm tired. Someone that I really do look up to that never complains about anything is Omar. Like, he guys look he does so much i see omar doing so much for other people where did these emotions just come from like we're in aquarius season relax i'm just kidding showing emotion is all right um but like he never complains so literally he's like a chicken without a head and we're both like that but i feel like he does more than me and he never takes life for granted and sometimes i feel like i do yeah it's I'm just tired. Just letting you guys know that I'm really, really just tired. Anyways, I'm gonna gather myself together. I ordered a laptop for like YouTube videos basically and it came in so I'm gonna go pick that up. Charger. Hi guys, good afternoon. So I just finished work. I took a shower and I got ready really fast. I have a doctor's appointment in a little bit for a checkup and I don't really have any plans for the rest of the day. I'm not really sure what we're doing today because every day has been just crazy. Um, so I'll try to check in with you guys later.
Çolpanan'dan geldi Şahin. Good morning guys, um, I'm getting ready to head out soon. I'm basically just trying to keep up with everything. Chief, what's going on there? Chief, you sense is something? Ta-da, I'm in the car. So I just had therapy and I also FaceTimed my brothers, which was nice. what day we are on for Aquarius season. I think it's like the eighth day or something like that, but I'm like in the corner of Starbucks trying to get some work done and I'm really stressed out. I just need like a full day of sleep. It also doesn't help that I don't feel well still. I don't know what's going on. It's not COVID. I got tested, so it's not that. I just, um, I also kind of feel bad because like, I don't know how my vlogging is doing and I just feel like I've been so negative the entire week. Probably not, but I haven't really edited any of the videos yet, so you know, it, it's it'll it'll be over soon and things will be much more calmer. I don't know. I don't know. I really do, I don't know. That's like my motto lately is I don't know. So I got a strawberry acai drink. I love this one. It's so refreshing. Birthday cake pop. Just a little bit. It's like 5.20 p.m. right now. I don't know if you guys can tell from the darkness. I finished maybe like 75% of my work. I still got a long way to go, but I'm gonna head home, finish the rest of my stuff, and then I'll be off for tomorrow. You're so predictable. What? I just guessed your pen. <laughs> Change your pen. Okay. Race? I'm spending time with you. I'm spending money too to rent a fucking movie that I could probably pirate. For <laughs> Hi guys, you would not believe what just happened today. My brother and I were watching a movie, just like relaxing, and then we hear like a loud crash outside. Come to find out that our neighbor from like up the block, his truck comes all the way down and hits our parked car in the driveway. I'm just glad no one got hurt, but our car shifted and it has a little bit of damage on it. My Capricorn brother and my neighbor are outside talking and we have the cops here like writing a accident report. It's so cold out, which is why like my nose is red, but what are the chances? Staring Mercury retrograde, like malfunction, coming down the road, like what the fuck? Everyone was just like laughing because it was so stupid. Race watched the entire thing happen and he barked to let us know. Good boy, good boy. So Omar just picked me up. We're gonna go meet with his friend, who's a Pisces, and his wife, who's a Capricorn. We're gonna have some Turkish dinner. I know we probably will be getting a blizzard tonight, but there's nothing right now. It's pretty nice out, it's just a little flurry. Also, the movie that my brother and I watched was called Hacksaw Ridge. If you guys haven't watched that, I highly, highly recommend that you guys do. It's about like war and religion and all that, but just like the true, intention of the movie is to not cause harm to others and you know save lives and omar is coming towards me <laughs> <laughs> so the movie is based on a true story and then i looked up that main character his name is desmond doss he ends up saving 75 lives so soldiers who were wounded all by himself Wait, slow down and I don't know, it was just like a very emotional movie. I googled Desmond Doss and he ended up being an Aquarius. I liked it. Yeah, I think he did. This one was Desmond. This one I like. What'd you say? I don't know, it's gonna be bad. Already saying snow.